Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to EU4. So we are in a war against... Don't really want to do that. That seems dumb. We're in a war here against... Uh, against these guys. The, uh, the Pomeranians. We're going to come down and, and crush them if we so can. Bye-bye, Pomeranians. Apparently, Ryuko just can't got a claim on my border here. That's not good. That doesn't make me happy. Because they're pretty strong. They're currently in a war, though. So that's, that's better for us. Then we'll come here and crush these guys. Yep, the more of these random armies that we crush, the better. Um, because they give us war score, for one thing. Minsk. So Minsk is actually good. These provinces aren't so much, but... You're allied with... you allied with Swinny Hinsui down here? Wow. That sucks for me. Oh, sweet. Morale of armies. That's really good. Okay, so we're losing a lot of money due to army maintenance. And I'm going to come all the way back into our territory, so we should start making money, rebuilding our manpower, um, all that good stuff. <laughs> this war is going to go on literally forever, and I'm guessing I can't directly negotiate with Pomerania. Um... Yeah, they won't give me anything because I don't have any war. I don't have any uh, war score with them, even though I won the battles. So that sucks. I can't really do anything, and that that frustrates me. What I can do though, while I'm here, is I guess um, boost my stability. I have all these points, and I won't be able to spend them anytime soon. I mean, it will be nice when I get to my next idea group. Cannons at level 7 are going to be huge. Out of curiosity, if I declared war on you, Manchu would come. The Platinate would not. I wish I could get in this war now. Um, currently we've gained the Diplomatic CB against somebody. Who are my rivals? My rivals are Kano, which... So I should be able to insult... Kano, and I should be able to insult... Luwu, and that should work. So if I send an insult, good, I got power projection there. And if I don't have anyone to send an insult with, I can't for another three years. Hmm. I can issue an embargo, though. Okay. So we did that. Wait, what? This province has defected to Malwa. Interesting. Yeah, um, Pomerania is not having a great day. I would really like to go to war with Lu Wu here. Oh, this prop Minsk just defected. A lot of these provinces are going to defect. My truce with Brazil has ended. Um, bye bye legitimacy. <laughs> My peace with Riazan has ended, which means I can send a diplomatic insult to them. Send insult. That didn't do anything. I don't get it. We have no truce, so I don't get why that didn't do anything. Yeah, that makes no sense to me. But Pomerania is falling apart, it appears. I doubt I'm going to get anything out of this war. Oh, look. Um, Hungarian rebels. That's good for me, too. 
And this province will eventually convert to uh, American here. Oh, peace has occurred. One sec, what happened here? They didn't give me anything. I got nothing out of that war. Way to fuck me over, um, USA. That were American buddies. Alright, so now, if I declare war... Only Manchu would come. USA would not come. Why not? Why wouldn't you come? Are you... Because you're in debt. All right, so there's an easy way to solve that. Um, economy action, send gift. I'll send you 25 gold. That should help with your debt problem a little bit. Now. Yeah, shut up. Um, if I declare war, so USA would come now. Oh, did my dude die? I guess my dude died. I didn't pay attention. That's probably why they're saying I could get a new dude. Um, well, let's get a new dude. He sucks. I'm actually gonna try to get a better dude. Actually, I am going... Yeah, let's try to get a better dude. Okay, he's much better. 2-3-2. Two, two. Now, if I can make... Let's make a, a leader out of my dude. Ice beast. Um, not as good as actually the dude I got. That's okay. So let's assign this dude because he has better. Um, wow, these are like really similar dudes. You are military tech 5. I am military tech 6. I think that might be enough to win this. USA would come. You wouldn't come. You wouldn't come. None of these are close. Well, let's try it out. So, we're gonna do it. Oh, they have 22,000. But we are winning this battle. That's good. We crushed that army. So, who came in on the war? Manchu joined the war. So, once I crush this army... Beautiful. I've stack wiped both their armies. There goes 22,000 um, dudes. So what I'm going to do... Why is this not working? Oh, because I don't have an army selected. Sure, you can have military access. Sure, you can have military access. I found the army of Manchu. Come on. Isn't this hard? Come on. This should work. We don't have a ton of manpower. What I do have, though, is... Um, I should have recalled that diplomat. That was dumb. Wow, there are a lot of dudes popping up, but we should still win this battle. Um, What I can do is gain some manpower. Not a ton, but some. So, this should crush this army. Beautiful. Where you at, USA? Why aren't you... Oh, because this is Luwian territory. That, I did not know. Did not know that was Luwian territory. Their ability to build dudes is a little bit impressive. Very impressive, I should say. But that's okay. Okay, we won that. Um, well, I'm going to... I guess I do want to siege Danzig, but so he's a two four three. That's why he's so good. And Manchu, Manchu is military tech seven. Oh wow, um, they have no cannons in this army. But wow, they're military tech seven. That was not expected. Uh, what I am going to do is hire a pair of mercenaries. To increase my my dudes. That's the plan. I'm gonna hire some mercenaries. I know I have troops in foreign territories. Get over it. Because I have the money. I don't have the manpower. So we're gonna crush this army. Please wipe it. Please wipe it. Ugh, I did not wipe it. That annoys me.
And when they're going probably all the way over to here. Yep, looks like it. How many men do they have there? Six, okay. Come on, wipe it. Wipe it. Come on, Jesus Christ, roll better. Wow, that, that was dumb. This is dumb. Oh, they got bronze cannons. Okay, can we can we finally goddamn wipe this stupid goddamn army? Thank you. All right, what I want to do is talk to Manchu. Manchu does not want to just get out of the war. Yeah, but they will soon. Meanwhile, we are going to siege our war goal. We have no manpower again. Which, as always, is a problem. And what I'm going to do... I'm going to take the... Uh, well, my guy just died, I think. Yep. This guy just died. That's too bad. But I'll take the yearly prestige, I guess. Um, I'm actually making a tiny bit of money. Um, so what I'm going to do is select army I'm going to consolidate the regiments which is usually not something you want to do but does mean that I won't have to worry about manpower nearly as badly and then I will hire um, some some mercenaries to fill out the, the army This is still Pomeranian. Oh, because uh, these guys came and immediately ate it up. Interesting. Corfu immediately ate that, that shit up. So what I would like to do is merge this, detach a siege, and then send the army down to take care of this. And we are losing money again. Now we're gaining money again. Now we're losing money again. Now we're gaining money again. Oh, we got discipline. That's fantastic. Come on. We need to get up here before... Um... Wow. These are all really bad. Um, for five years, I'm going to gain increased national unrest. That's really bad. Okay, I'm making money again. At 0% war score, that's good. Or 0% siege here. 21% siege, very good. Um, we can upgrade to our morale of navies. I don't really want to do that right now. When do I get this? Level 7, I get at 760. I'm just going to wait for that. Oh, sweet. We finally turned this into American. Yep. 42% chance of... Uh, Um, we're very close to, is any of these cannons? No. Okay. Um, once we win this, we'll come and crush these guys. Please win soon. Please win soon. Please win soon. Thank you. The Siege of Gdansk is, Gdansk is over. Are you? Okay, so we, our colors are so similar, it's hard to tell. Um... All right, let's go to their capital and siege that next. This will give us another idea group, and then I'll have to seriously consider what idea I'm going to get. I'm going to spend these Diplo points. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to have to seriously consider what idea I want when I get my next idea group. Uh, the one thing I do have to consider, though, well, also is having enough admin points to take this. Oh, Lulu just got, um, thing. Ice Beast 2.0 came to the throne. Ice Beast 3.0, also known as August, is sitting here. Um. Uh, Riazan has declared war on Pomerania. Are they going after this piece of land? Uh, that's my guess. Are you D-bags? My ports are blockaded. My one port is blockaded. 
This is a six. Yeah, some, there's some good lands up here that I want. Wow, they already got 11,000 dudes. That's um, a little scary. 12,000 dudes. I do have a... Uh, uh, I do have a um, major discipline advantage. Um, let's, um, by the way, allow attaching to this unit. Let's also recruit. Why can't I see the mercenaries? Mercenaries. Let's get one uh, longbow mercenary right here. Yeah, if we could just win this siege, we're already at 42%. We're already at 42%. Yeah, if, if if you guys would just, you know... If you guys would just come on down here, maybe. Maybe you can't go through that land. I would really like to win this goddamn siege. Please win this stupid siege. We're at 42 goddamn percent. They're at 21 goddamn percent. And they keep going up every time. And I still haven't won the siege each each cycle. We're coming. We're cycling around again. I slowed down to speed three. Oh, of course they win their fucking siege. That is such bullshit. And then I win my fucking siege. It only took them like 50 years. But I finally won my goddamn siege. I am so pissed off about that. Now I'm going to crush this army. Bye-bye, 3,000 dudes. Bye-bye. Please win. Thank you. So you're going to go to Podonsky down here. Poznan. Why aren't you doing anything, America? Please win. Okay, good. We're, we're crushing them. We were crushing them. Now, now we're kind of crushing them. They're going to get to walk away from this fight, though. Yeah, that's too bad. Uh, I'm annoyed about that. And I'm annoyed that I have to re-siege this stupid thing. Let's see, um, we need to create a new royal marriage. That's fine. Um, I know I can invest in tech here, but this is the problem. Uh... All right, let's see if we can win this stupid siege again. We have a minus two modifier. We still have a minus two modifier because we got the goddamn status quo. Um, yeah, we're not having a good luck, any good luck with this stuff here. We are having no good luck with our dice rolls when it comes to sieges. Ah, oh, we got a supply shortage. That's great. The reason these things are... Are you finally coming? Holy shit, you're on the move. You're not in another war, are you? No, you're just, you just finally decided to show up. Wow. Shit's happening, guys. We can go back to speed four. This is crazy. Shit is actually happening. Nobody's managing to make any progress in any of their sieges, but shit is happening. Oh, they're under attack uh, in the west as well. Zazu and Nuremberg are attacking on the west side. We're attacking on the east side. It's going crazy. Meanwhile, uh, the Pomeranian Super Empire is collapsing. Alright, so we're at 28%. Um, this one's not as good as the other one was, but I'll take the Papal Influence. Um, and I'm going to actually try to become the Curia Controller. Where are we? We should be in this list somewhere. Where we, Where's my bitch at? Here we are. 10% chance of becoming the the uh, the Pope. 
I realize I'm running over my time now, but I really, really want this to end. And I also want to get like a decent amount of stuff out of this. Luwu wants peace. I'm not even going to entertain their offer. Um, I do have a ton of Diplo points. Oh wow, I also have a ton of war exhaustion. Bye bye war exhaustion. Hello stability. Hopefully I'll have enough Diplo points to actually try to take the piece that I'm going to want once we can get there. So I'm, I'm, it, for those of you who are unaware about, you know, how EU4 works compared to CK2, you basically spend war score to, to obtain peace. So the more war score you have, the better peace you can get. Um, oh, I did not want to decline that. I wanted to allow that. That was a big mistake. They're probably upset that I didn't allow access. Yeah. It's too bad. If this runs on for much longer, I'll end the episode. Oh. Okay, let's see if we can... Oh. I guess I gotta go goddamn help my allies out. Yep. That's what you do. Unfortunately, that reset my siege. Which is, uh, annoys me. Oh, I can't upgrade, though. That's good. Let's get to military tech 7. Which means I'll be able to build cannons in the future, and I will do that. Um, I guess we're getting spy offense, which sucks, but whatever. Sweet. Alright, what can we get out of this war? So this will give me ridiculous aggressive expansion. That would make a lot of people unhappy with us. Riazan being the most important of these. Oh no, and and Majertine. Ryuku would get a minus 40. So what if I just took Gdansk? That's a 16. This wouldn't be nearly as bad. And then what if I gave these two to America? And let's see, can I have you release anybody? Oh yeah, release those guys. Have you annul your treaties with the Palatinate? You don't want to give me war reparations, do you? And some gold? I'll take every last thing I can get. Alright, so I think this will be okay, and I won't end up fighting a ridiculous war. Sweet. Um, so let's core this. Okay, I did that. And then let's do this. Which uh, gets me another idea group, which is great. And then I can decide what I want to do on the next episode. So this is definitely where we're going to end the episode. I thank you guys very much for watching. Danzig, huge province to get um, for a whole bunch of reasons. It's an uh, important center of trade. It's uh, got an estuary. It gives me access to the ocean. I should now have, you know, maybe a naval limit. I do. So yeah, we're doing, we're doing a little better. With that all being said, though, I thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you all next time.